All right, so Sunday was National Coffee Day. We're still celebrating here. <laughs> uh, and there's nothing better with coffee than baked treats. So today we have the Bluff Park Coffee Collective in the kitchen with us. We have Ramsey Nuss with Good Neighbor Baking yes. and Burt Davis with Day Soul Coffee. So we're glad y'all are with us today. We wanted, to, let's start with the coffee real quick. Mickey had some questions about the coffee. Yeah, but they, these two came together and just kind of formed a new business. How did that happen? Yeah, so we connected on social media, I think, when it was before COVID, mm -hmm. like a long yep. time. Yeah, and so we just started a partnership, I guess a friendship, and we like would kind of trade product. Like he'd try my cinnamon roll, I'd try his coffee, yeah, and then I would, it. with, because I had just started my business, he had just moved to the area, so. But you don't just carry coffee, you actually mm -hmm. roast we do. Coffee yes, there yes. And we're a local Birmingham roaster, so everything's roasted here. Um, I roast it. We have our shop, our retail location in Bluff Park Coffee Collective. And uh, what what makes a good cup of coffee? Can I pop some of this right here? You can pop that right there. <laughs> that, that's our cold brew in a can right there. Okay. You know, there's so many factors into a good cup of coffee. It's how it's roasted, how it's sourced. Oh yeah. How it's brewed. All those things come together. That's good stuff. That's just good old black coffee that's right it. there. That's it. Cold black coffee. So that's, that's the it. way I like my coffee is black. It. I just drink it that way. Well, I like to have treats with my coffee. Okay. So we're going to talk about some of the treats over here. You brought some. I want to open yes. the box up so that we can actually see some of them. Your, what would you say is oh your best goodness. seller? So we have a lot of wow. like popular items. And like the cinnamon roll is most popular. I didn't bring it because mm -hmm. we are already out, came from the kitchen. Out. So I was I like, think the, I think the um, oatmeal cream pie though is really good. Okay, so the oatmeal cream pie is Nick probably, love that. well, mm. we, someone picked up like, cause I sell them in like the very miniature mini size. And mm. so they were, they did get to Nick Saban a few years ago <laughs> and oh! so that was really exciting but people were like if you could just make them really big and so when we opened the store I was like I'm just gonna do like the large I call them OCPs everyone's when I call them out over the counter like wait what did you say <laughs> like oh sorry it's oatmeal cream pie oh, but um with OCP OCP oh, yeah. yeah exactly <laughs> so anyways uh we have this uh pumpkin cream cheese muffin top I always like try to like take something that I feel like people I don't know, like a like the pumpkin muffin is really popular, but how could we kind of elevate it a little bit? So everything we try and do is just like slightly elevated, to try and keep people coming back and like wanting more. I'm like, what are you gonna do this next week? I so love we're, that. Yeah, I guess y'all are in Bluff Park. We are, the, we are. Ramsey and I both live in Bluff Park, mm -hmm. yeah. so we're neighbors. It's our community. We're in the Shades Mountain Plaza. If you're familiar with where the old Piggly Wiggly was, yeah, we're in that shopping center okay. right there, right next to Mason Music. And, and you around? have more than just the cold brew and stuff. There's yes. lattes. Oh yeah, I get yes. the lattes all the you time. You can get a high quality, really good latte. Mm -hmm. um, we can make pretty much if you drink it, we can make it. Yeah. And y'all are also doing something to help um, people who've been impacted by Hurricane Helene. Tell us about yes. that. Yeah, so we are serving as a drop-off location today through Saturday morning. Folks can bring in. Um, items that are needed. If you go to our social media page at BP Coffee Collective, uh, there's a whole list right there of things we need and they can bring them in and drop them off. We'll make sure they get to everyone. Yes. That's okay. so sweet. And while you're there, get out. some coffee and a pastry. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Mm -hmm. I love that. Yeah, and we just try to, so like whatever I know, I, you can take anything you want out of that box. Okay, but, I'll just take the box. But yeah, but what we do is like, I want to try and support him and vice versa. So like, he'll tell me what, if there's something special, he wants to do like a special latte. I'll be like, well, how can I help that experience? So that's kind of that. what we try to do with our You're going to get the best coffee and the best pastries in the same spot. All right. Yep, I mean, that's right. <laughs> that's all, right. Folks. Be sure to stay tuned. The news at noon is next. And I'm wide awake. <laughs> <laughs>